It's important to take care of ourselves as best we can. At times, it can be hard juggling work and family life, but it is possible. Today, we'll focus on three areas of life that we think are really important to general health and wellbeing. We all love food and we need it to survive. So how do we get the most out of it? Our local Harvest Market store here has a great range of fruit and veggies. Now we aim to have three or four different types of fruit in our home. We snack on them, cook with them, and sometimes even bribe our daughter with them too. Fresh fruit and vegetables provide essential nutrients that we need to feel healthy and well, and to stay well all year round. Now buying fresh produce in New Zealand is different from season to season. Now try to remember this when you're planning for your shopping list or meals for the week, as this can tend to raise the price of your groceries when you want things that are hard to come by or not in season. I use a range of cookbooks for our meal planning, as well as the internet for quick recipe guides. There is so much information out there and heaps of ideas so that your family won't get bored eating the same things each week. Ever heard of the golden rule, drink eight glasses of water a day? It sounds like a lot, and if you're not used to drinking water regularly, it might be a lot for you. Water is a vital part for our bodies to be able to function and stay healthy. It aids digestion and absorbs all the food that we eat and it regulates our body temperature. Now I drink two glasses of water as soon as I get up in the morning. It wakes me up, cleanses my system, not to mention my mouth, and gets my stomach ready for any food that might follow. If you need a reminder to drink more water, try carrying a water bottle everywhere you go. You might find that you're less sleepy in the afternoons and aren't as likely to crave energy drinks, fruit juices that are full of sugar. Getting into good habits like this will also rub off on your family members too. And we all love our kids to drink more water. New Zealand water tastes so good. Well, Christchurch water does anyway. The next time, try ordering a meal without a drink and just having water. That way, you'll save money and be drinking something that is great for your body. I would love to have 10 hours of uninterrupted sleep, but that can't always happen. We all need differing amounts of sleep in order to make use of and enjoy the hours that we are awake. Only you are the judge of your body's physical needs and how many hours of good sound sleep you need. Once you figure it out, try to stick to it. You'll be amazed at the benefits and how good you feel. Remember though, that this is just some general advice. We understand that a life with a family or other responsibilities might not make this a regular thing. Do what you can and enjoy the results. Being active is a great way to clear your mind and look after your body. After all, we're only given one. Being active with a group of people can make exercise more fun and social. There are heaps of council at exercise groups that are always welcoming new people. There are groups for walking, team sports, you can do personal training sessions at the gyms, and even swimming pools. The list goes on. These are some ideas that we have found work for us. For more information on health and wellbeing, go to your local library or look on the internet, or just ask your neighbour. Your health awaits you.